Hey everyone, hope you're good today. It is Wednesday. I'm losing track of time, but it is Wednesday. I think. Yep. Um, I've only had four parcels to send. Um, I wasn't any point in showing you me picking them out because you saw me listing them. It was the video player. It was the camera that sold in under two minutes. It was the Jurassic Park case and number plate. Video, Jurassic Park number plate, camera. And there was something else that's quite big, which I will remember. Um, I haven't, hadn't had a um, order today until about five minutes ago. When the phone made a noise and um, I sold uh, one of my kids DVDs Peter Rabbit so that sold so yeah it's um oh and the other thing was the JVC back to the future camera which is going to Chile so yeah I'm ju I've got two bits being picked up by parcels to go tomorrow by separate companies they're going by separate companies um, I'm just taking one to the post office that's going special delivery which is the camera and the um, the DVD player is going by UPS so I'm dropping that off at the shop so I will show you now the parcels I'm sending because I've cut down boxes I always Frankenstein boxes to cut them down pack them well and make them all nice so I'll show you them now So there are my parcels that are going, that's one I'm dropping off, the VHS, that is the JVC, that's the Jurassic Park one, and I've got a cut down box, and that one is one that's going to the post office, which is the camera. <laughs> back from the post office stood in the post queue for about I reckon 20 minutes got there put the special delivery I haven't sent special delivery for a while um, and they've always sort of been lighter ones put that on the scales I said how much is that special delivery they paid 12 quid 26 pounds I think over two kilos so I'm just gonna try and redo that now um, three parcels to go get it cheaper and get it sent with the uh, with the video player so now I'll go and drop them off so I'll speak to you in a bit right that's how I do it I went to the post office I wanted nearly 28 quid so I went home onto parcels to go got it for £17.20 with UPS fully insured and tracked and took it to a shop with the with a video player so that's it all up to date apart from the one that came in about it's probably about an hour ago now so literally all I've sold today is a DVD which I paid a fiver for a bundle of clothes and stuff some time ago now it's been in my car for ages because I don't go anywhere I've got a couple of a couple of robots got that big one there and a Robo Sapien there's a load of toys and bits in there and there's kids clothes and all that which I'll just get rid of because I don't, I don't bother with kids clothes and that. There's no point but there's a few toys in there and so I've got two robots, I've got the ink cartridges with it, I've got, um, got some ink cartridges, yeah and some DVDs, only really one or two of the DVDs are okay, the, the other ones all scratched and and knackered so yeah so I paid a fiver for it all I've sold a sold bunny ink cartridges for eight quid sold a DVD for four ninety nine with shipping so I probably got six quid off the I'll say five quid with fees five quid off the ink cartridge um probably I would say three quid off the uh, DVD 
and I've still got ink cartridges, I've still got, so I've got the two robots. That one there, there's something wrong with it, I think, it, I don't know whether it's a controller, because it, every time I'm driving it sort of makes a noise and talks. Uh, the Robo Sapien's got some loose connection on the wiring, but that's still worth 20 quid or something, 25 quid. All day long it works with the controller, just needs the wires bounding up with electrical tape and and just the, the uh, dodgy connection sorting. So that's a good bundle. Uh, yeah, so that's that. It's been a busy but not busy day today. I haven't done any listings yet, but I'm going to crack on with some when I get home. It's now nearly 20 to 6. So I've been running about like a lunatic today. Um, picked up a couple of bits, obviously with social distancing. But I was going to a shop up by where I picked it up from anyway. So I picked up a load of um, two bags of Blu-rays and DVDs. Um, and with that I picked up two pairs of trainers that someone bought in the States. And they had to wear them to be able to bring them back. They couldn't bring them back new or they'd have got charged for importing. So they've been literally worn once. Um, yeah, a pair of Nikes and a pair of... I can't remember what the other ones are. Um, so I got them for 15 quid for the two pairs of shoes and the DVDs and Blu-rays and I picked up some old slide machine I can't remember the actual name of it but I'll show you that when I get back because I picked that up for 20 quid which is probably it's probably a 50 or 60 quid machine but, and it's got a spare bulb and all that so it might go for a bit more and still got the little books with it so yeah so still grinding still getting on grinding the work away um, you just got to do what you got to do but whatever you do stay safe make sure you stick to social distancing and you know just just do the best you can all right i'm going to jump off now but i'll speak to you in a bit <laughs> huge tonight that's it over the roof of a bungalow down near me I can't zoom in anymore but it's absolutely massive wow just thought I'd show you 